tomorrow, November 23rd, 2022, will go down in the history books as the date to where Lillian Finance changed forever in melted faces. Lillian Finance will be listed on Binance, Kraken, KuCoin, or Coinbase. In fact, that announcement will be made public tomorrow. And I hope you've packed your bags, got your snacks, and your popcorn, because it's about to be on and popping. We'll get into that and more coming up next. How's it going, family? Welcome back to the channel, guys. You may see a lot of bright smiles on my face, and you know what? You should be smiling too, especially if you got a bag of Lillian Finance. Guys, tomorrow, November 23rd, 2022, you've been put on notice. This is when faces will be melted. Guys, take a look at this. This is directly from the Lillian tribe, the Lillian official Twitter, they're putting us on notice, telling us, hey, tomorrow we can expect Binance, Kraken, KuCoin, or Coinbase to come out and make that announcement about Lillian token being listed on their platform. Now, I'm not saying that it's going to be listed tomorrow. It may. We don't know. But we know for sure that the announcement in terms of which one of these four top tier one exchanges that will be listing Lillian token, that's when that announcement will come out. Guys, I hope you are as excited as I am because, hey, like I said before, guys, you should have brought your rocket ship, your propellers, anything you can think of, your spacesuit, because guess what? We are going to move from this earth and we're going to the moon, guys. That price is going to go parabolic because any one of those listing or making an announcement that they will be listing Lillian token will just be amazing, guys. Now, before we get into more details about this, let me remind you to go ahead, smash the like button. It really helps YouTube to spread the word about this channel. And last but not least, we would love for you to subscribe to this channel, guys. We've been growing exponentially and for right and rightfully so because we are bringing the fire, guys. We keep bringing you the news about these diamonds in the rough and all of these cryptocurrencies that are moving and shaking in this crypto space to hopefully make you and your family generational wealth in the near future. So we ask you to go ahead, subscribe to this channel. We promise you, you will be happy that you did so. Now, let's get on into this, guys, because like I said before, it's about to be on and popping up in here. Let's get into this, guys. Now, what I want to kick us off with is showing you this pricing action. Look at this, guys. Look at where we were. We were tra trading sideways ever since. I would argue ever since July, May time frame. We had a little small pump trading sideways from August all the way leading us up to the announcement that, hey, there have been not one, but two centralized exchanges that are confirmed. Remember, I said the word confirmed. That ain't the same thing as speculation. Confirm meaning it's going to happen. It's going to be on and popping up in him pretty soon. So going back to this chart, we see this. October, once that was announced, look at this. We see the price pump. Now, as we get closer and closer to November, look at that steep incline, guys. We have been seeing 100% increases on a weekly basis for a couple of weeks as of the time of this recording. And we see we went down, we retraced. We had a nice little sell-off there. You know, it's one of those buy the rumor, sell the news type things. But guess what? Lily and Trop, they came back and ate that dip. And then we see that the price retraced, and look where we have been ever since. Guys, once the news broke that tomorrow, Wednesday, November 23rd, 2022, is going to be when that announcement's made, look, the price has been going parabolic. We started off at about 9016 level, and we have not turned back since. We're currently sitting at 9057 um, level. Now, what I want to do is, because I, I, I like to educate you on this channel, we got to put this into perspective why this is such a big deal because a lot of cryptocurrencies that have been existing today longer than Lillian Finance has been in existence have not even been listed on any of these top tier centralized exchanges. I'm going to repeat that. Binance, KuCoin, Kraken, and also Coinbase. None of them 
So you know what? At this point, you got to put some respect on the name of Lillian Finance because they are doing something that most cryptocurrencies that are out there, most meme coins or other cryptocurrencies that may have been around a lot longer than Lillian Finance have not done. You got to put some respect on that, guys. Now, let's dive into this, guys, because we like to educate you. Any one of these centralized exchanges that will come out to announce that Lillian token will be listed it's going to make that price blow through the roof binance obviously is the granddaddy of them all sitting at about 14.5 billion dollars in transactions buys and sales in the 24-hour period coinbase coming in hot and fast at number two sitting at a little over two billion dollars Kraken sitting at around 876.6 million dollars and qcoin sitting at 620 million we're going to ignore binance us because in my opinion binance is binance you see binance number one binance number two binance us is number four here so that's the second binance because they're different entities but binance is binance that's how i came up with binance coinbase Kraken, and qcoin is the top four right okay now you got that now i am speculating here that and there's been some other speculations out there too around floating around the crypto sphere about which one of these exchanges is going to be announcing that they're going to be listing Lydian Finance as on, on their crypto exchange. There have been rumors that it may be Binance, there have been rumors that it may be Qcoin, there have been rumors that it may be Coinbase. But you know what? I'm going to stick with one of these two. I'm going to say it's either going to be Binance or it's going to be Coinbase. I may be correct completely wrong but it's fine even if i'm wrong it doesn't matter guys because you get binance qcoin Kraken, or coinbase any one of those zero killed instantly so in my opinion in my book not financial advice but in my humble opinion that's good for the lillian tribe and it's good for your pocket it doesn't matter which one but let's play devil's advocate here let's play a little game called devil's advocate let's say if it's binance or coinbase you know you heard of this thing called coinbase effect Yes, it's a real thing. The Coinbase effect. There are other YouTubers out there that are speculating that Lillian token will be listed on Coinbase. So let's roll with that. I will subscribe to that speculation. I think it has good merit. So let's go ahead and use that as our test case here for the speculation, shall we? All right, let's do that. So we're going to say it's going to be Coinbase, guys. Let's go over here because I want to show you why it's important about this thing called the Coinbase effect. What's important about it? Now, here we go. The various effects of Coinbase listings. Well, number one, it's going to add additional liquidity. The token's liquidity gets a significant boost as more people are now exposed to it. What do I mean? I'm glad you asked. Here we go. So imagine Coinbase coming out, sending a tweet saying, hey, guys, we Coinbase, we are proud to announce that Lillian Finance will be listed on this date, they're usually going to give a date and a time that the spot trading will be um, occurring, meaning you can buy and sell on the spot, right, using the centralized exchange Coinbase to buy your Lillian Finance. They imagine this. They come out and say, hey, we are proud to announce that we will be listing and opening up trading for Lillian Finance coming Friday. That will be, let's see what date that will be. That'll be about the 25th of November. I'm not saying this is what they're going to say, guys. I'm just speculating. So hang tight with me here. Just subscribe to this sheet of music that I'm trying to show you. I'm just trying to teach you something here. So stick with me. Now, Coinbase comes out and says, hey, we are proud to announce we are listing Lillian Finance to our platform open for trading, spot trading here on Friday, November 25th at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. At that point, can you imagine they're sending this tweet to their millions, millions, and millions of followers, guys? That is going to open the eyes of so many potential investors about what Lillian Finance is. And best of all, Lillian Finance, they are what I call transformative technology. They are going to be groundbreaking technology. Their primary use case is going to be creating a medical blockchain, guys. That's disruptive. Anytime you have disruptive technology, you bet your dollar you're going to have what's called institutional investors coming in and buying up that crypto. Institutional investors, what do you what, what does that mean? I'm glad you asked. Institutional investors, think about big money. Think about those loan bucks. Not one ETH buy, not two ETH buy. We're talking about 
30 ETH buys, 50 ETH buys, 100 ETH buys. I'm just speculating here, guys. I know that's a lot of money, but you get the point of what I'm trying to say. If we go back here, that is what they are talking about, about liquidity being added. Liquidity meaning that that pot of money, that slush fund, if you will, that you can sell your crypto from. So if you don't have liquidity, you can't take profit. So that's why I support it to have liquidity. It helps the project to move like a smooth oil well machine. That's the purpose of liquidity. Now, let's go on to the next point that I want to bring home to you about this Coinbase effect. It increases the price of the token. What do I mean by that? So here it is. The long-term effects of a Coinbase listing are also positive and might lead to an increase in the price of the token. Some of these long-term effects include an increase in the number of wallets that support the token and an increase in the awareness and recognition of the project. Now, let's break that down, guys, like spaghetti for you. So we you, we, we got to get you to understand what this is talking about. Because, you know, all this stuff that I just read may be cryptic for some of you newbies out there. So what does this mean? Hey, when, like I said before, when Coinbase makes the announcement, speculation, but we rolling with this, we subscribing to the sheet of music just for the purposes of our conversation here. Coinbase announces it. They send a tweet out. That's millions of people that are going to be exposed to it. There are millions of people that are literally sitting there looking at tokens that are being launched on these centralized exchanges, and they're dropping some money in it. And also, on top of that, with, the, with that exposure, can you imagine with all of the zeros that Lillian Token has, that is appealing to people that don't want to put a lot of money in it. They can put $1,000 and get trillions of tokens. They can drop $100, $100 and get millions and billions of tokens. That is appealing to people because people want to think big. People think in terms of, man, wow, what if this went to a dollar and I got 300 billion tokens? Oh, my gosh. I'll be a billionaire 300 times over. Not realistic, but I'm just saying, you know, that's how people subscribe to that sheet of music. So we're going to play with it. We're going to roll with it, guys. That's the importance of this point here where we talk about increase in the price of the token. Now, let's move on to this third point. Interest of other exchanges. Another long-term advantage is that it might lead to more exchanges listing the token, which would relatively also increase its liquidity. This is because people, more people would be aware of the token, and as a result, more exchanges would want to list it to capture the increased demand. Now, let's break this down for you guys. Crypto exchanges, centralized exchanges make their money on what's called transaction fees. In other words, let's say Coinbase lists Lillian token, right? Okay. Flash forward, the news came out. We've seen the run up in price. We got some new holders. Voila. Now it's being traded on Coinbase. What comes next? Coinbase is now making massive, massive revenue from the exchanging of Lillian token because every time someone goes on their exchange to click buy execute buy order what happens is they take a they take a portion of it a little snippet little bitty piece of that pie and they, they put it in their pocket that guy is called transaction fees and you know what else happens when people sell yeah because people are going to sell that's the nature of crypto you're going to sell you can't take profit you can't realize profit till you sell that's the nature of crypto people are going to buy they're going to sell now people sell Lillian token on Coinbase, what happens? Coinbase makes profit from the transaction fees. They're getting paid both ways. They're getting paid profit on buying when you buy. They're getting paid profit on selling when you sell. Not only that, some people may want to transfer that token outside of Coinbase into their non-custodial wallet, which essentially means a MetaMask, essentially means some other decentralized wallet like Trust Wallet, etc. That where you own the crypto, meaning because it's your keys, it's decentralized, it's not a hot wallet, it's not sitting there on a centralized exchange. So when that happens, Coinbase most likely would take a piece of that pot. So even though it's not a fee, it's essentially they're keeping a portion of the Lillian token on their exchange as liquidity. So they're essentially realizing more money because the value of the token goes up. Guys, that's what that means in terms of this point here. When we go back where it talks about interest of other exchanges, it means that once, once Coinbase decides to list Lillian Finance, what happens is the crypto becomes so popular and because it's listed on one top tier one centralized exchange out of the big four, that I'm going to call it the big four, Binance, KuCoin, Coinbase, and Kraken, right? Because we already talked about Binance US. It's kind of Binance, just separate legal entity. That's why they split it up. But the point is, if it gets listed on one of those top tier one exchanges, 
all of those other top tier one exchanges are going to want a piece of that pie. And what's going to happen, guys, is this. You're going to see Coinbase listed. You're going to see Binance fall in line. Kraken going to fall in line. Qcoin going to fall in line. Bitfinex is going to fall in line. Gemini is going to fall in line. Bitstamp going to fall in line. Coincheck and OKX and Bybit, etc. All of these, you get the point. All of them are going to line up to the table hungry, saying, hey, we will list you, Lillian Finance. Please let us list you because they know what's up and they want a piece of that pot. Now, back to this point that I was making. On to the next one. It says increase popularity on other platforms. This point says it could also pave the way for the token to be listed on major exchanges such as Binance or Qcoin. That's what we talked about. This is due to the increased awareness and recognition that a Coinbase listing brings. Coinbase has also been known to help with the price discovery of a token. This is because when a token is listed on Coinbase, people can buy it directly with fiat currency. What do I mean? I'm glad you asked. Okay, now let's break this down for you. Once it's listed on Coinbase, that means you will be able to use fiat to purchase it, meaning you can use your debit and credit card to purchase lending and finance. Mind you, we are early in crypto. We understand decentralized trading. We understand using Uniswap to swap. We understand cold wallets like Ledger. We understand things like MetaMask. We understand things like non-custodial wallets like MetaMask and Trust Wallet. We get that. But we are a smidgen percentage of the population out there that truly understands how crypto works. Let me explain this further for you. What I mean is once it's listed on Coinbase, now people will be able to just simply point, click, purchase. No swap. Point, click, purchase with a debit or point, click, purchase with a credit card. That is simple. And being that that has a lot of simplicity in the mix added to it, that will make a lot more users flock to purchasing. Lillian Finance, which in, in a turn, in a sense, helps to make the price continue to go parabolic. You see the, you see here, you see the sheet of music here, you see the, 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 the moral of this story. The moral is where you want to be is listed on a centralized exchange that's a top tier one, top four, top five. Because once you get on one, you can bet your dollar more are coming. Now, let's go on and look at this price again. Because it's probably changed since we looked at it last. Look at this. It's gone up even more. We are 38.61% up higher than this time yesterday. Guys, that essentially means you your holdings are worth 38.61% more now than they were this time yesterday. That is mind blowing. I would argue to say we are already experiencing a parabolic move, right, guys? We are already experiencing parabolic movement. We are sitting at 162% up on the week. Guys, as I mentioned to you before, this is just an appetizer. Now, let's look at the broader crypto market to see where Lillian Finance stands in terms of the overall market. Look at this. We are below $800 billion. We are below the $1 trillion coveted price point. In fact, we are down 1.11% over this time yesterday. The two movers and the shakers, Granddaddy Bitcoin and the, and the child Ethereum, they have been struggling as of late. As of the last 24 hours, Bitcoin is down a little over uh, 0.10%. And then Ethereum is down a little over 0.34%, just changed. But we are seeing some green turn into the market because over the last hour, both Bitcoin and Ethereum are turning to the green side. Now, let's look at the, the uh, feed and greed index because this gives you an overall sentiment of what people feel in the overall crypto space right now. We are sitting at extreme fear, which is a 22. We are sitting in extreme fear. We have been since the last month. Now, why is this important? I'm glad you asked. The reason this is important is because Warren Buffett said it best. When there is blood in the streets, in other words, when there is extreme fear in the market, you need to be greedy. In other words, you need to be scooping up that crypto. You need to be packing your bags. You need to be backing up the truck, stacking your bags, dollar cross averaging in, meaning that you're buying crypto at a lower price because it's on discount. It's on sale, guys. But you know what? You wouldn't know that <laughs> looking at this chart for Lillian Finance. They're saying, eh, eh. We don't care what the market is doing. We're going to continue to pump this thing up. We're going to pump it up, guys, and we're going to continue to go parabolic. 
That's what I have for you guys today. T minus one days, guys. You've been put on notice. You better go grab a bag because guess what? We are in for one heck of a ride. And I hope you bring your spacesuits and your popcorn and your candy because it's going to be on and popping, guys, tomorrow. Not financial advice, but I'm just telling you how it is, guys. Lillian Finance, there you have it. Lillian Finance is going to be listed on one of those top tier one exchanges. Actually, two that have been confirmed, but the announcement is going to be made tomorrow, November 23rd, on which one is going to be. Will it be Binance? Will it be KuCoin? Will it be Kraken? Or will it be Coinbase? You be the judge. Go ahead. Join the conversation below. Leave a comment in the comment section. I'm, I'm curious to know, what do you guys think is going to be? Who do you think is going to be? Do you think it's going to be Binance, KuCoin, Kraken, or Coinbase? I think it may end up being Binance or Coinbase. More than likely Coinbase. I believe that, guys. That's where I stand, objectively. That's where I stand. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel, guys. We'd love to have you to be a part of the family. And thank you so much for watching this channel. We'll be back to you guys when breaking news comes out, which I believe will be real soon.